Stansford. And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. He sends this one deep. He's to the 10. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Quick throw to the tight end. They'll bring him down at the 25. The quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. That brings up second and one. Second down and around one yard to go. Ball on their own 25. And he's taken down at the 27-yard line. And the short gain is enough for the first. And that tailback definitely has a nose for that first down marker. from their own 27-yard line. First down. Looks to pass. He fires. You don't want to ever give your opponent a second chance, but that's exactly what they did by not making that interception. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. He's on the run. Tackle around the 33-yard line. That's good for a gain of 40 yards. First down. Excellent execution on one side of the ball that time. And it looks to me like the defense was in a little state of confusion. Let's see if they can pull themselves together. From the 33-yard line, it's first down. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Strike to his receiver, no good. Alert read on that play. He didn't have too much time to react to that pass. We played one. This one's scoreless. A minute left in the half. Hit immediately. Next reception. Number 17 on the tackle at the 15 yard line. First down. And down he goes at the 14. The halfback picks up a yard. That brings up second and nine. sets them up with a first and goal. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. And the goal line defense digging in here. On the handoff, he will score. The halfback just plowed his way into the end zone. Yeah, but it wasn't all him. The offensive lineman just pancaked the defense on that one. Tennessee up six. And he adds the extra point. A nine play, 84 yard drive. And it results in a touchdown. Looks like they're ready for the kickoff. 
set to return. He puts it deep downfield. And they can forget about returning this one. They'll set up shot at the 25-yard line. First down and back to pass. There's a strike complete. He's taken down right around the 32-yard line. That'll be a seven-yard pickup. That's a good completion. They didn't get the first down, but they picked up about seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He drops back. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. And he hits him hard at the 32-yard line. The Volunteers don't like the looks of things. They're going to take their first time out. Tennessee's a little confused. They use their second time out. He really got a hold of that one. He's tackled at the 25. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Tennessee up seven points. They'll go Brown. He's to the 40. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. Touchdown, Volunteers. And that's his second touchdown of the day. That was just an excellent individual effort to find the end zone. So at the end of the half, the Volunteers in front, 14 0. Second half just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Number 15, deep to return. He got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. For Stanford, this is now a game where they can't afford to waste any possessions. Aaron Andrews will give us more details. EA? Brad, the exact words the coach used coming out of the locker room were, we'll learn some things about ourselves in this half. His team has a lot of fight in them, and they always give it their best effort. Effort isn't the problem right now, he said. They're just getting outmaneuvered. Obviously, the fact that neither team turned the ball over made the coaches happy. Brad, back up to you. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And they make the stop at about the 23-yard line. Loss of two on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Teen yard line. Call it a loss of four yards on the play. That'll bring up third and nine. The defense just met the blockers head on and drove them back straight into the runner. From their own 19 yard line, it's third down. Looking to throw. He heaves it deep. A great catch. 
Touchdown, Cardinal. What a display of pure speed. You know, any time this guy touches the ball, he has the ability to go the entire length of the field at that speed. Splits the uprights with the extra point. So a short three-play, 75-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot, and they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. The score now, 14-7. Stanford lines up for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 10. Brought down at the 14-yard line. They'll go to work at the 14. Tennessee is up seven. Brought down at the 16-yard line. Stanford's going to use their first time out of the half here. That makes it second and eight. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 16. He's tackled in the open field. That'll be a gain of five. Here's a safe play hitting the underneath receiver, but it's a nice gain of five. Brilliant work by both defenses through three quarters of play. Who can open it up in the fourth quarter? Whoever does has got a great chance to win. Tennessee's lead is a touchdown. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. It's absolutely deafening down there. And he is drilled at the 11-yard line. Man, it's an offensive lineman. This is the worst thing that you want to see. Is your quarterback not only getting sacked, but getting hit like that. Those linemen better pick that quarterback up and start doing a better job of taking care of him. Fourth down. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. We have less than a minute to go. Safety. You don't think the defense was coming extra hard on that play? They knew they could force a mistake, and they made a big play. for a punt following that safety. Number 33, back to return. He makes it to the 28-yard line. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Well, everything is out the window now. It's crunch time. They have less than a minute to drive the ball downfield and get the ball into the end zone. Right now, they're fighting the clock and this defense. Final drive here with less than two minutes to play. first he's tackled around the 31 yard line they work hard and they got the turnover well this is what it's all about defense taking advantage of an opportunity they're pouncing on the loose ball The whistle hasn't sounded yet. They still have to snap the ball and make sure they don't make any mistakes. Ready, 
It's a great tackle at the 36 yard line. Stanford will take their final timeout. Second and 15. Ball on the 36. Under a minute left. Drops back to pass. This one's going deep to the end zone. Almost picked off. And I don't know if this quarterback misread the defense or just made a poor decision, but that wasn't a pass he should have thrown. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. It's getting louder down on the field. He's looking to pass. He rolls out to the right. Tackle made right around the 14-yard line. That's a game of 22 on the play. That makes it first and 10. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. such a good job of disguising his blitz. As a linebacker in college football, one of your biggest responsibilities is being able to get to the quarterback. And that time, he timed it up perfectly, was able to get through the offensive line and put the pressure on the quarterback. And they got him. Really great game to watch. Both teams should be proud of their efforts in this one. 14-9, Volunteer. And the Cardinals, nine. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. I was impressed with both teams out there, but the difference in this game came down to execution and playing mistake-free football. Stanford had a lot of chances in this one, but a number of costly mistakes squandered those opportunities. Eliminate the errors, and this one could have gone the other way. Here's a look at today's player of the game. So that wraps things up for us. For EA Sports, Aaron Andrews and Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time. to pass. This one's going deep to the end zone. Almost picked off. And I don't know if this quarterback misread the defense or just made a poor decision, but that wasn't a pass he should have thrown. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. It's getting louder down on the field. He's looking to pass. He rolls out to the right. Oh, man.